at 5.30, a San Anselmo man has filed a lawsuit against the Central Marin Police Authority after he claims they stunned him with a taser and arrested him while he was suffering a seizure at his home. The incident was captured on police body camera video. Crown 4's Gail Ong has details and a warning. Some viewers may find the video tough to watch. Police! <laughs> Police body camera capturing the call to Bruce Frankel's San Anselmo home on the early morning of August 29th, 2022. Oh, oh, oh. Frankel's fiance at the time, now wife, called 911, but when officers arrived, the situation escalated. Put your hands your mouth. What's his name? Bruce. Stop. Stop resisting. Don't fight, so you're gonna get tased. You're gonna get tased. Frankel later learned he was suffering from a grand mal seizure. On Wednesday, Frankel filed a lawsuit against the Central Marin Police Authority. His lawyer, David Fiol. He's still struggling with the physical issues and still struggling with the emotional issues from this. Uh, he had two shoulder surgeries. Um, so he's recovering from those, which occurred over the la last year or so. The lawsuit alleges excessive force, false arrest, and officers conspiring to fabricate charges. One of the responding officers can be heard giving a statement on police body camera video. I feel like it's all kind of happened fast, but I feel like he, like, checked me. So I tried to control, like, his arm, and then it was just, like, resist. We fell onto the bed. I was just trying to, like, uh, get him on his stomach to detain him. But he, uh, he tends to start he, the first initial yeah, physical yeah. aggressive contact. A statement from the Central Marin Police Authority reads in part, quote, As much as we would like to, the authority by law is precluded from commenting upon medical and personnel matters that are deemed confidential and private. However, the authority will vigorously defend itself against this meritless and factually inaccurate litigation. A separate statement to Cron 4 from the lawyer representing the officers reads in part, the officers who arrived on scene to help in response to the medical call did an extraordinary job under very difficult circumstances. Mr. Frankel presented symptoms that mimicked someone under the influence. He was irrational, unstable, and violent. While we now know this was the consequence of a seizure, at the time the officers had no such information and acted in accordance with training law and policy. The lawsuit seeks economic damages for medical expenses and punishment sufficient to ensure that the situation does not happen again. This department has seen the similar set of facts before, an epileptic suffering a seizure. Um, years before this occurred, uh, the officers mistook it for something else and beat and then arrested a person who was suffering an epileptic seizure. Gil Ong, Cron 4 News.